wondering, you probably already read the, uh, the title, but if you didn't, I'm sure you're wondering why am I recording in my pajamas? I got my sleep mask on. Well, because today we are going to have a slumber party with the one and only Robin Sterling. I managed to find her at Walmart. Um, I will leave a, uh, a link to her uh, in my bio for a little while. Um, she was a bit more expensive than I thought. She was 50. I thought that she was supposed to be 35 initially, but she's Walmart exclusive. So link to that in the description down below. Here's the art on the back, which I will try my best to salvage. So we're going to go ahead and open her up. Uh, if you guys saw my uh, last doll unboxing on the channel, we unboxed uh, Sasha from the uh, anniversary line, and I was not having fun at all, so I don't think I will be having fun with this either, but I will try to complain less. start. The tape is being evil. So while I'm unboxing her, I guess I could chat with you guys a bit. So, um, last, yeah, it was last Friday, the Animal Crossing Direct had aired, and I did a reaction on that. If you haven't seen that yet, I highly recommend you do. Uh, I asked you guys if you wanted to see gameplay for the new DLC that's coming out. Yeah, hi, this is Stars from the Future. So the poll actually ended, and I'm excited to say that I will be doing gameplay for Happy Home Paradise once I get everything, you know, set up and together. So I hope you guys will be excited for that. How do you... Okay. This is so much bigger than Skylar. Can I, can I say that? Am I allowed to say that? It's so much bigger than Skylar. I feel like I'm unboxing this wrong. Oh yeah, I unboxed this wrong. But you know what? I, I do not care because this part is just gonna get destroyed anyway. So yeah. Um, also, I hope you guys are ready because it's getting close to the end of the year, which means I'm going to be uh, posting my annual uh, Stars Taku uh, channel analysis, I guess. Like a poll where you guys tell me what you liked about this year's videos, what you didn't like about this year's videos, what could be improved so that way I know for next year what to deliver you guys. And you know, any suggestions or anything like that. Uh, I have not made the poll yet. I usually post it in December. Like, yeah, I usually post it in December. So be on the lookout for that. Maybe start rewatching videos from this year. Uh, if you need, uh, I guess I can make a playlist of videos I posted this year to help you guys better. If I do, it'll be in the, in my link tree, in my bio, like everything else. Okay, um, alright. Great. Alright, first thing I'm pulling out here is her sleeping bag. Here is her sleeping bag. It smells new. It has that nice, like, new smell. And it comes with this little pillow. Um, of course, all this stuff is detachable. But I don't know if I'm going to detach it. So this zipper is functional. In a way. I think I might have to detach this. Guys, the zipper. Here we go. So you can zip her up in there. Uh, you can kind of stick her pillow in there. I might do that later. Uh, put that down here. Uh, let's go ahead and get her second outfit out. Oh, what is that? I don't care. Like I said, it's it's all getting destroyed anyway. Safe for the back because I want to try and save the art. So here is her second outfit, which I'm definitely going to change her into because I don't know how I would feel about her first outfit. 
So she has like some nice silk pants and a nice top to go with it. And has um, these really nice shoes. You know, this one isn't as bad. Unboxing this is not as bad as um, unboxing Sasha was. That was a nightmare. That was like a whole nightmare. Uh, okay, let's get these shoes out of here without breaking them. And then it comes with these these slippers. All right, guys, these high heels that actually have like puzzle on them. That's pretty cool. There. Okay, time for the main attraction. I freed her from her prison. Um, this is going to be fun. There's lots of tape on the back. MGA knows how to secure their dolls. That's for sure. Banana, how do you do this? I, I just, I'm just gonna keep calling her out every single time. How do you do this? You do this, you've done this for like years upon end and I just, I just don't know how you do it. How do you have the patience for this? I just kind of want to rip her out and show her off. But I can't do that because then that would damage her. I need to be gentle. I'm gonna cut it here because I'm gonna figure this out, but if, you know, if I manage to say anything funny, which I probably will, I, I'll come back. She's really pretty though. Uh, it looks like a new mold or something, I don't know. Analysis later. How do I free her? That's the question. Pull out gently. No, I don't want to, I don't want to risk it. You know that saying, risk it to take the biscuit? I. This biscuit you want to take out very carefully. Oh no, that's not good. Why was her hair in my scissors? Did I cut something? Do you guys see what I'm saying? Like, what is all this? Okay, is she free? Is it is it safe? Did I break anything? She is so. $50 well spent. Wow, $50 well spent. I cut her hair. She, I'm in awe of how beautiful she is and like how high quality she feels. Like her hair. I kind of want to go get Skylar so I can compare the two. But wow. Okay, we need to talk about her because I'm just in awe and I, I just... I don't even think I want to change her outfit. Oh. Oh my wow. I am just I'm just shocked. I'm in shock. Um what was I doing? Oh, right, hi, camera rolling. Yes. So this is Robin. She is a performing arts major. This is like the highest quality doll I've ever like held in my hands. I feel like I'm holding some kind of sacred collector's edition. So um, there are her little slippers. They are bunnies. She has some lace socks. Um, she has this really cute fancy robe with some nice fur trim and the sleeves are very sheer. Um, I don't want to undo this bow because I know I'm not going to be able to put it back. Um, so her original outfit that she comes with is this sleep top covered with jewels and then she has like sleep shorts underneath and then she has pearl earrings in. Um, her eyelashes are real. So it's a combination of them being uh, drawn on to the face but then she also actually has real eyelashes that pop out um, I love her edges 
that's pretty. Um, she has a face mask. Uh, these eyelashes are not real, they're stitched. Um, her hair is absolutely fantastic. This really feels like such a high quality doll. I have this necklace that says Rainbow High on it. Um, wow. Um, she doesn't come, I didn't see any, uh, I didn't see a stand, I didn't see a clothing hanger like, um, Skylar did. But let me see if I can... Let me see if I can look through here and see if there's something like... Aha! They hit it. Okay. So here's her stand. And... Oh! Clothing hangers. Perfect. I don't know why they would hide it behind the, the box. It doesn't make sense. So her color is also... Um, color is ice. Oh yeah, she does come with the comb, but we don't care about that. This is about Robin and how high quality she feels. I'm still in awe. Um, so maybe I will change into her second outfit. Yeah, well, let me change into her second outfit. Uh, I'll put her other clothes on the clothes hanger and then we'll go from there. I'm gonna keep her eye mask on because it just feels like it's stuck there. Oh my gosh, I can't get over her hair. This doll has like a full head of hair it doesn't feel like cheap or skimpy or like okay let's just put a few here to make it seem like the doll has full head of hair but it doesn't and it does feel like a new mold like compared to um Skylar now I wonder if they re-released uh like at some point they re-released series one of the original core Rainbow High characters with the new with the new model, new mold, because this definitely does feel like a new one. Um so I wonder if I wonder when they started using this new mold. Use the new mold starting with the twin, because I know I was reading something about that. So I'm gonna go ahead and change it to her second outfit. You know what? I forgot to mention. I forgot to mention that her nails were painted. Oh, and the pants are elastic. They don't have um, that annoying little Velcro thing. Okay, that took too long. Um, here's her second outfit. I don't think I'm going to be keep keeping the shoes because they keep falling off. But I will. I'll try to put them back. shoe go okay consider the other shoe lost but here's your second outfit without the shoes uh it's a long sleeve crop top so i think i'm going to keep this on her wow it's upside down but that's okay. At least it, it's on. It's on. That's all that matters is that it's on. And she is ready for her sleepover. Let me see if I can put her in her um in her sleeping bag. So let's let's show off this outfit that I have for her. There you go. Very nice. contraption in here and I I don't know is this to hold her down or is this was this packaging you know what I'm gonna take it out because I'm going to assume that it was just part of the packaging nobody goes around no uh, I don't I'm taking it out you know what no, I'm taking it out if you guys want to keep it in there you can I'm taking this out 
I don't, I don't know what it is. It's bothering me. Come on. There we go. Garbage. And she does fit in here with her shoes, by the way. With with it unzippered, obviously. Zippering it is the is the true test. Let's see here. Oh no, yeah, she does fit in here. Um, with her shoes on. You can have her in her sleeping bag, like this, fully zipped up, with the shoes on, so that's really cool, or, oh, um, and her pillow. Um, pillow, yes, okay, pillow can be tucked in the back if you try hard enough. So you could display her like this with the um, sleeping bag on or you could have her with her stand which is blue and glittery. Um, I want to say this is a lighter blue than Skylar's stand. Uh, I honestly don't know what I'm going to do. I might alternate. I'm not entirely sure. Uh, I might try to get the pink one next maybe um so yeah there you guys go hopefully you guys enjoyed again all the links will be in the description uh i will list her the description as well and if i find any of the other girls on there so thank you guys so much for watching and don't forget to stay kawaii